Go. Hello, my mindful yogis. Welcome back to Move Nourish Heal. I'm Mike. Here with Mr. B. Just gave me a heart attack because I'm on top of a big cliff here and he nearly went right over the edge a second ago. So I wanted to just quickly film like a five minute morning movement practice, okay? So again, I keep making shorter and shorter lengths of time. Five minutes seems to be like a really sweet spot for a lot of people. You can't really make an excuse for five minutes of your day. So we're just gonna move through some sun salutations, a couple nice stretches, just like, you know, five or six minutes um, so that you can find time even on a busy day just to move your body, okay? So hopefully, this one here doesn't beeline straight for the cliff like he just did a second ago. He has zero, <laughs> zero fear of heights. So that's always fun. But uh, yeah, after I'm done the flow, I'll show you. So I'm just like looking out over a beautiful landscape here. I'm up in Killarney, Ontario at the uh, Killarney Provincial Park on George Lake, just doing a couple of days of camping here. It's about four or five degrees Celsius right now. So this is even colder than when I did my flows in Iceland outside, but still like no excuse. You can move your body anywhere. Um, and yeah, let's just do that. Okay. So you're going to come into child's pose. Just getting in a few minutes of movement. Take a breath in, settle down into the pose. Inhale. And exhale. Breathe in. Press back. Come up to tabletop. Just hear a few cat cows. Wake up your spine. Curl the toes under. On your breath in, look up to the sky. Cow pose, tailbone up. And then exhale. Press the ground. Round your back. Cat. Do two more like that. Cow. Last one, really feeling it out. Wake up your body, yogis. Doesn't take long if that's the intention, if that's the focus. Move into a downward facing dog. Just feel out your first down dog of the day, maybe. Maybe it's not your first one. Feel that like full body stretch here. Press down through the heels, root down through your knuckles, press back through your tailbone. Three legged dog on the right side, open up your side body. And just wiggling it out, feel out any cracks in your joints, any tightness. Switch sides, left foot up. Bend your knees, stack your hips. Press down into your mat. Feel that big opening. And come to the top of your mat. Ragdoll. Feet hip distance apart. Breathe in. And breathe out. Really let the upper body dangle down. Feel like a big stretch in the spine and in your neck. Release your fingertips down. <laughs> Excuse me, where do you think you're going exactly? Come up to a flat pack. Shadow chasing at its height right now with this one here. So just try to make sure he's not uh, <laughs> gonna plummet. <laughs> Take an extended mountain. Reach up, press down into your feet. Fold forward. Halfway lift. High to low plank, slowly lower down, upward facing dog, lift your thighs, your shins, downward facing dog. Take a breath in, take a breath out, lift up onto your toes, bend your knees and hop or step to the top, flat back, fold. Again, extended mountain, really press, feel a big full body stretch. Sit down into chair pose. Take a breath in, sink a little deeper. One more, big reach, big stretch. Fold over your legs, halfway lift. 
Chaturanga Dandasana. Height to low plank, lower down. Upward facing. Pull your chest through your arms. Downward facing dog. Right side warrior one. Just take a breath and a half. Reach up. Sink down into that front knee. Big breath, long upper body. And then plant your hands, flow it out. Upward facing dog, press down. Downward facing dog. Left side, warrior one. Reach, stretch, stay for the exhale. Big breath in, lengthen the upper body. And release, Chaturanga Dandasana. Upward facing dog. Downward facing dog. Take a breath in. Oh, hi. Take a breath out. <laughs> Inhale. Exhale. Step onto your toes. Bend your knees. Step to the top of your mat. Come down onto your back. Move into a bridge pose. Just one. If you want a wheel, go for it. If your body's not quite warm enough for a wheel, that's okay. Just really feel this. this is a nice lifting up through the hips. Get your glutes in. Get your core involved. Breathe in. Breathe out. Hey. Take another big breath. Lift up into your hips. Feel that. Really press down. Open up. Breathe in. And come down. Mr. B, get over here. I don't want you to be on this side of me yet. Go over there. Go oh, 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 over there, please. Over there. Don't no cliff diving you. <laughs> Take a thread the needle quickly on the right side. Just pull it in. Buddy, please stay over here. Come on. He will beeline straight for the cliff if there's a shadow. It gives me heart attacks all the time, but we'll see. That's not gonna happen, right? Let's not do that. <laughs> Switch sides. Thread the needle on your left, pull it in. Give yourself a squeeze. Hug your knees into your chest. And then rock up to sit. Take a seated forward fold. Legs out in front of you. Fold over your legs. Squeeze in here. Inhale. Melt a bit deeper. Big stretch through the neck, through your spine. Take another breath. Come up to sit. Bring yourself into a seated position, cross-legged or whatever's comfortable. Just gonna take a couple seated poses and then we'll call it a day, yeah? So stretching, grab your left wrist with your right hand, pull up and over, side body stretch. Draw back that left shoulder blade. Breathe in, breathe out. Come back up, switch sides, yeah? Lengthen the right side body, draw the right shoulder back. Breath in. Open, gentle twist here. One more big breath. And release. Hands to heart center. Touch in. Acknowledge yourself for taking a couple minutes to move. Hands to your heart center. Oh, no, sorry, to your forehead center. Together we bow. We say namaste. I'm not sure how long that was, but it felt good to me. Yeah, just... um. Try to make yourself, no, don't try. Make time for yourself to move every day, okay? A few minutes is better than skipping it and making the excuse that you don't have time, okay? Everybody has five minutes that you can carve out of your day, whether it's first thing in the morning or not. Keep moving your body, keep nourishing your body, stay connected to your yoga practice, and I will see you again really soon. Whew, you're scary. Come here, over here, come on, over here. No, come over here, come on, come on, you're okay. You're okay. Yeah. Ready to head back down that cliff, you? Yeah. Oh, thank you. Very nice. You want to see what's on the other side here? What?